Hey, what up? Lazy here as always. In this episode, we're back on Forza Horizon 5 and we're here with this, the 1965 Mini Cooper S Forza Edition. So this is the 50% overall for Season 5, I think it is. And this is an actually electric car and I'm pretty stoked for this and we're going to take it drifting. So let's jump in and get this build started. Okay, so since this is an electric car, there's not very many upgrades we can actually do to it. So we can upgrade the motor and battery. So we got the sport and we've got the race. So I'm going to go with the race one. It gives us 305 horsepower and 225 foot pounds, which isn't too bad. For the tire compound, I'm going to want something slippery. So I'm going to go with the snow tires. Yep, that'll work just nicely. As for the rims, I actually want to go with these, the Work Emotion T5R2 pieces. They actually look really good on this. Wrong button. Alright. So, for the sizes, I'm going to leave them at 12s all around. We could go up to 13s, but honestly don't really want to. Alright, jumping into the drivetrain. There's nothing really in here apart from the diff which I'm going to chuck in the drift one. Yep. And now jumping into here. There's no brake upgrade, sway bars, or weight reduction. We do have the choice of rally and drift suspension, which I'm going to go with. So here we go. Got 305 horsepower, 225 foot-pounds at 1,433 pounds overall. And it's all-wheel drive, which is actually not too bad for an EV. Awesome, so there's the build done. The paint's already done. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that awesome stuff. It is much appreciated. Cheers. All right, now let's jump over and drop in a tune. Okay, so this car's going to need as much help as it can to slide. So I'm going to bring the rear tire pressure up to 55. And for the fronts, I'm going to go with about a 45. Yep, right there. All right, so for the gearing... I want to bring this more towards the acceleration, so I'm going to go with about a 440. That should bring it out to somewhere pretty decent. For the alignment, I'm going to leave the front where it is at 5 degrees negative, and I'm going to bring the rear up to the same at 5, and I'm going to go 5 degrees out toe in the front and in the rear. All the rest of the suspension should be pretty good. If you want to download this tune, share code is at the bottom of the screen. As for the brakes, I'm going to go with my usual 30, 140. A little bit too far, so right there. And as for the diffs, I'm going to lock the front at 100. And zero is good. 100 and zero in the rear is good. And I'm going to bring this back to 80%. Awesome, so there is the tune done. Now let's give this thing a rip and see how it goes.
awesome so there we go 1.13 mil isn't too bad i'm actually really surprised especially with this being an ev i didn't really think it would have it in it to do that but overall this thing's actually pretty solid and you can munge it in spots where you can't in regular cars because it's really small but that's it for the video for today thanks for watching stay safe and i'll catch you next time later